for Sarah Sandrick is live in the North Valley newsroom with how prosecutors are responding. Sarah. Well, Graciela, this story has touched the hearts of animal lovers across the valley and even around the world. Now they and the Madeira Police Department are requesting charges be filed against the dog's owner. This fluffy pup named Harry is now on the road to recovery after a painful ordeal. He arrived at the Madera County Animal Shelter on June 16th with rubber bands wrapped tightly around his muzzle. Staff members say he needed 50 stitches to repair the deep cuts on his face. And he felt a lot of pain, a lot of discomfort, and thirst, and, and he was starving too at the time. Madera police say the woman who dropped him off, Anna Zarco, claimed she had found the dog in a park, but they later determined she had him for two months, and one of her young children had bound his mouth. It's still not clear how long Harry was left like that. It makes me very emotional, you know, um, to see the pictures we posted on, on Instagram with the stitches only, a lot of people didn't actually get to see the true damage that was done, and um, some did see it, and they were just outraged. Cynthia Peraza is a local dog lover whose pug, Portia, has her own popular Instagram account. She reached out to followers and started an online petition calling for justice. It's since been signed by more than 2,000 people from around the world. Afghanistan, United Kingdom. Peraza and her son delivered the signatures to the district attorney's office Monday morning. We want him to know that all this right here are the voices of the nation, of, of everyone wanting justice for Harry. And no more slap on the wrist. We, we need harsh, harsher punishments. Supervising Deputy DA Karen Mitchell says she welcomed the public input but had not yet received the police report. Detectives expect to deliver it Tuesday morning. I plan on prosecuting it and um, so I'll review the case, determine what charges and go from there. We tried contacting Anna Zarco today but were not able to reach her. As for Harry, he's set to have his stitches removed tomorrow. Portia the Pug and her owner were able to meet Harry today and they've now signed up on a list of people hoping to adopt him. Live in the North Valley Newsroom, Sarah Sandrick, ABC 30 Action News. Thank you.